Charlie Cannons, Charlie Cannons, boom, 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 we are not pirates. Welcome everyone to another 3v4 watermelon shark episode as we close out the year here on the Rocket League. We're all green and pink and have shark fins. It's fin Let's all join Team Orange this time. Team Orange! So I to get the reverse effect. Ooh, yeah. Ooh. Yeah. okay. How did your Team Orange? Guess oh, what? wait, hang on. Oh, wait. Can, wait, can we pause and just hit? What's happening? No, I think it just defaults us to the blue. No, oh. I don't think that. Whatever. Resume game. Well, so much for that plan that didn't work out even oh, at all. Okay. Here we go. All right, it came on. <laughs> I promise we look just as good in orange. Right. <laughs> yep. It's not better, really. <laughs> oh, go, 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 Oh, man. There's just so many. Oh, man. Things. I flipping, flapping, freaking. Flipping, flapping, flapping. Oh, flappin'. oh bored. Alright, so we have a question today from Sasha. Oh, Sasha. How you doing, Sasha? Hey. Uh, she says, oh, Sasha. I could really use some advice. I've made new friends who I guess I've known casually oh, for a while, but never really became close friends until recently. Mm. Uh, now that we're closer as friends, I guess I talk to them a little <sighs> differently. Not in a bad way. I'm just a little less formal, more playful. Uh, sometimes I gently poke fun, which I worry can come off as rude or mean. Um, a lot of my other friendships are built on this playful banter or even affectionate insults, mm. which might sound contradictory, but it's inside jokes, and my friends understand that we're not actually being mean, we're just poking fun because it's fun. Uh, however, these new friends don't really know that side of me yet, and mm. now that I've started doing it, I've... I, uh, oh, lost my spot. Um, now that I've started doing that, they misunderstand and have called me out for saying something that's rude or not nice. And it could be the case that I just need to be nicer with them, but I'd like to be able to speak in my own voice and with my own personality. I'm not really sure how to communicate this with them. Uh, also, we're all in martial arts together, and they're of a higher rank than I am, so respect is really important, even though we're the same age and friends. Okay. Boy, I'm not familiar with that at all. The martial arts aspects the of martial it? martial arts of life. Yeah, I, like, you're higher than me, so I need to respect yeah, you. No. I mean, maybe in class, but, like, that, right. you oh, know, real world, let's, let's, see that. Is not, let's be real Oops. here. Well, and, like, I think that we can, we can relate to that to the tune of the fact that the four of us are friends outside of the office. Yeah, but, yeah, like, yeah. when we're here, technically, there is, like, a hierarchy, mm, kind sure. of, sort of. Not that it really comes into play that often in this environment, yeah, anyway. Not super often. <clears throat> but, like, no! oh, man. I certainly I do think name. that, um... There are probably, like, I don't know, situations where it could come up in that way. Nice. Oh, oh, yeah, I thought that was it. Oh, oh. Gonna do it. Um, no, the big thing about, like, playfully, you know, being at jest with your friends is whether or not the thing you're saying is, is actually mean. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like, mm. if you're playing on someone's insecurities, that's mean. Yeah. <laughs> and this is the kind of thing where you can't rely on them telling you either because they might like just I don't know feel uncomfortable approaching you about it so my advice would be to like over apologize almost like just yeah. be anytime you joke be like absolutely clear like I, I, if you if you genuinely thought like you might have crossed the line like um <laughs> Because I think a lot of people, everyone's done that before, where you think, uh, I made a joke and I realized later, like, oh, I actually kind of feel bad about that. And uh, probably they understood, but just in case, I want to be clear. Right, I, like, right. I, it, it's totally fine to just go back and, like, say, hey, I said earlier this, I just realized that maybe that wasn't cool. And, um, Ooh, nice. I just wanted you to know that, that, that super did not mean that. that. <clears throat> Oh yeah, I mean, like, you have to be on top of things for sure. But, like, the other thing is, is that if they're taking it that seriously, like, may maybe even though you feel that comfortable with them, they don't quite feel that comfortable with you yet. Mm -hmm. um, you know, where it's like, you, you might just have to give them a little bit more time to, to match pace with you, or at the very least, even get used to your sense of humor. Right. Um, mm -hmm. But, like, this type of, uh, I mean, banter, maybe? I feel like is is pretty much at the foreground of most friendships. Like it's a it's a pretty common thing to like bust each other's chops. I mean, just ask right. Jordan. <laughs> Love you too. Uh, um, so with that though, you guys only ever tease me about things that I would joke around about anyway. Like if you were teasing me about something that I was genuinely insecure about, it, I wouldn't have ever made jokes about it myself. But like 
the easiest one to point to is that I'm just sometimes a caricature of myself. <laughs> so, um, only sometimes, though. Only, only sometimes. sometimes. <laughs> Hardly um, regularly. <laughs> <laughs> right. Maybe, maybe. But, so that's something that I joke around with, therefore I am, you know, telegraphing to you guys that right. that's okay to joke around with. Right. But if it were something that I were insecure about, I wouldn't. So that's this person could maybe listen to what people joke around about with themselves. That's probably a good rule of thumb. Like, wait for them to strike first, so to speak. Right, 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 right. yeah. <clears throat> uh, also, like, uh, one thing with this, if... Uh, and this isn't something that anybody said, but maybe just for other people who might be listening to this. Uh, you don't get to decide what offends somebody. Like, if they are like, that was too far, and you were like, it's not that big a deal. Well, if they said it was too far, then it's a big deal. Yep. That's true. Right, right, right. right, right. Yeah. Like, when, it, when it comes to friendships, you're playing by, yeah. the, like, like kind of their rules to exactly. some extent. I mean, and likewise the other way. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Um, so it's, uh, I think, I guess, what I, the reason I bring that up, I, I saw a post the other day that was probably more politically oriented, but it's something along the lines of, just because you're offended doesn't mean you're right. Um, in like the sense of politics or something, maybe that is a different thing, I, I, depending on the situation. Mm -hmm. uh, with friendships, though, it's like if you've offended your friend, then you did the wrong thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Regardless, you know, it's like. Um, <clears throat> well, it, and I think the key difference between that is that you know friendships are very much a a back and forth street, whereas like politics. <laughs> Involve yeah, the, the, the larger community yeah, 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 yeah. as a yeah. whole. I bumped a lot of cars. Wow! Yeah. Car bumpers. I'm still trying to figure out what the updated bumper. scoring system is. Yeah, I don't I know, know, right? Like, the like, numbers 274. Seem... What is this? Maybe, maybe we are getting uh, points for bumps now. Maybe. Yeah, well, yeah. What? It seems sure that they're not ending in zeros. I wonder what that's. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. I don't know. Or five. We'll have to look it up. Mm. And now I think. I, Tink, I think. I think. I think it's time. You know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna just roll with it. Now I think it's a time for our sponsors. <laughs> Today's sponsor is Clark. Clark says, Happy Hanukkah, Merry Christmas, Happy Kwanzaa, and Safe New Year to everyone in the SCB family and community. Oh man, and a warm, happy Christmas Kwanzaa could to you as well, Clark. Oh, Whatever classic Clark. Always just being so open-armed and welcoming. Mm. We Indeed. do appreciate it. He is the embodiment of the SCB community. Oh man. He is very active in the old Discord. Met him over at the, uh, he's been to both the meetups. Yeah. Both the meetups, yeah. ran the Spartan both race with us. Yeah, yeah. Help people throw people over a wall. Yeah! yeah. My recollection didn't get even to face them. <laughs> <laughs> I, you think, know, it's I a, think that was a special treat for you, Jay. Special treat for me. I need to wear like a chin guard at the next one. <laughs> at the next one, yeah, yeah, yeah. indeed. <laughs> Actually, yeah. speaking of, this is not really a sponsor or anything, but uh, we are doing another Spartan race yeah. uh, next oh June. Gotta be in Discord. Gotta, Gotta be in the, the Discord, Discord if you want them beats, though. Yeah, so if you've seen Jay's vlog where we go and do all the all things Spartan, mm -hmm. it was so and fun. you want to be a part of it, yeah, we go as a team. You want to be a part of the Sparta. The, the there Super Carlin for a brief moment while we were there, I literally thought I was going to get injured or just wouldn't be able to finish the race at all. And it ended up being so much fun, and I cannot, like... Yeah! You need to consider it. Yeah! yeah no, so it, good. It is ridiculously fun. It is really... In, ca in case you're wondering whether or not you can do it, the metric I've come up with to, to what I believe is necessary in order to successfully complete one of these... Yeah. ...is if you can pretty much jog three miles. That's probably it, because, like... If you're gonna like compete, then yes, you need to know how to do the obstacles and stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But if you're just doing it as a giant team hangout thing, then realistically, whatever. We're there it's to help. There. Yeah, it's just there. I mean, because we had people who certainly were not like, uh, didn't train for six months to do a Spartan race, but everyone right. finished. Right, right. And plus, you know, like there's the burpee rule where if you can't complete an obstacle, you have to do burpees. We just did them as a team. That's right. Yeah. Oh, wait, we can we take we... some of those burpees for you. Yeah, Ben. Ben position. Ben, go. Oh. Ace it. Give it the old ace a room. Oh, man. No. I think because they have, have four. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so they have somebody yeah. in the corner. It means that they have somebody in the corner. Yeah. Well, Don't put aces. somebody in the corner. Huh. Woo. Uh, jumping back to... Or did we want to talk more about the uh, playful banter? Oh, come on. Oh, uh, somebody yeah. smash them. Uh... What was the question? Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, Good point, Derek. <laughs> I'm helpful. Um, 
Yeah, no, I've, I've had. Uh, oops. Oh, uh, I've had a fair bit of all this as well, and I know my father has it uh, as well. My mom always, oh, uh -oh, uh -oh. uh, said about my father that uh, if uh, he likes you, he will make fun of you. If right, he doesn't like you, he will respect you, and that's when you know <laughs> he does not yeah. like you. Oh, right, 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 yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> How are you supposed hey. to like somebody you respect? I, mean, I know. It's right? just science. Yeah. <clears throat> um. Yeah, it's like I, I think it's like the idea of like I only play pranks on people I like. Yeah. Oh, so right, it's yeah. like, you know, you're you're not if you're doing it, it doesn't mean anything harmful. It's like this is just the way that you show you show your affection yeah. through yeah. Joshin. That is such a thing. Like if you pray, like the pranks are so weird like that because on the one hand you have people like you who would only do it to people they are already friends with, and as such, it's like becomes a yeah. part of your friendship. But then on the other hand, if you pull pr pranks on something, if you can do the exact same thing to someone you just didn't like, then it'd be straight up bullying. Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, Woo. what is the best prank that you have pulled on each other? Uh, oh, oh, that's best I also want to know this. Uh, I don't even know if I would call it like pranks, but we were talking about this over the weekend. We used to do this thing called the GMA gift exchange. Yes. Oh, oh boy. It was like, Planned sort of pranking. It was, sort of. Like, we would wrap the presents so that they were as hard to open as oh, humanly man. possible. Yeah, yeah, so that was. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, we, we would get pretty creative. That was really the point of the oh. gift exchange, was to <coughs> make the gifts as hard as possible. Like, the actual item was always just sort of whatever. Right. Because right, we were right. all pretty poor in it high would, school. It yeah. would be like a belt buckle, right. a water <laughs> bottle, oh, you know, it was never anything like particularly cool, but that didn't mean we weren't going to set it in concrete for a month. <laughs> <laughs> Good luck. Uh, man, I, I think, uh, I think I wrapped one of your gifts with a pond, Beth, Ben. Beth. Sorry, Beth. Oh, that's okay. Oh boy, you guys we do look a lot so alike. similar. Everyone, I've heard so many people in our family complain that you and Beth's names look so similar in their oh, food. Yes! Yeah. Sometimes I've gotten a text from like Beth before and been like, wait a minute, what? Oh, I see. <laughs> <laughs> Why does Ben care? Yep. Yeah. Um, yeah, no, so once Jay literally uh, went and sank my gift in the middle of a pond yeah, in yeah. the middle of winter. Yeah. And I had to go and get it. Yes. That's amazing. It yeah. was amazing. Oh, I did. We have one of those like dry bags you might bring on a on a canoe trip or camping or whatever, and uh, I just put the gift in there and uh, went out a week early, tied a little rope and milk jug to it so we you know so we'd mark the spot. So, so we knew where it was. So we don't want to lose, we don't lose yeah. that water bottle. And then uh, I just gave Ben a set of waders and said, "Go get it." <laughs> And you know, I had to make sure that it was like right at the line of like where the waiter. Yeah. Like yeah. if you make like any bit of wrong move, it's like it's coming in. <laughs> <laughs> oh That's man, amazing. that was pretty That's good. Pretty one. Good. I had good one, one once where I um, I sank uh, the again in water the present in the bottom of a five gallon bucket and then put a lionfish. Yeah. Oh man. Give it a live guard. <laughs> yeah. Oh boy. Which I think maybe had more more wow value than it did oh, actual practicality. Yeah. But <laughs> ah, you got stung. We need to go to the ER. <laughs> <laughs> and uh -huh. Christmas turned into a problem. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Really funny. Um, I pranked my sister a couple of times growing up. Uh, there was one time I convinced her that her birthday got taken out of the calendar. Oh, that's <laughs> nice. Um, I don't know. That couldn't uh, have been too hard. Did, did you Maybe say the words, me. hey, they removed your birthday from the calendar? Yeah. No, I pretended that I didn't even realize it was her birthday. Oh, oh so this wasn't like like at another time of the year. It was on the not a day anymore. Yes, okay. exactly. Did you actually just forget and this was your way out? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Cause I feel like that's something that I would have done. I'm like, well, this is a prank now. <laughs> <laughs> Leaning into it. <laughs> exactly. Right. No, this is my fault. I actually think I got her concert tickets for that birthday, so oh, I like yes. sent them to my mom and was like, here, when you guys open presents, just show her this email of concert tickets. Oh, um, so you weren't even there. Well, yeah, I was I was in Miami at that time. But how old was she that she fell for this? Keep in mind, she's like nine years younger than I am. So... Yeah, but still? <laughs> <laughs> 12, maybe? That nope. seems too old. I think that one's on I, her. I think, <laughs> <laughs> I think by your time you're 12, you should know that you Ooh, can't Oh, yeah. come on, I was there! This, would, for me, would have been a situation where I would have, like, completely known that it was a prank, but I would have, like, not wanted to have embarrassed the person by letting them know. And I'd be like, Oh, you forgot my birthday. Oh, I can't believe you did that. But, like, in reality, I'd be like, yeah, you 
didn't actually forget my birthday. I see what's happening. <laughs> That's funny. Um, and I'm trying to think if there were any other really good ones. Oh, um, one time when she was really, really little, uh, did you guys ever do the thing where like if an eyelash fell out of your eye and you, you could make like a make a wish, wish on it? Yeah. So I like explained this to That's her real. in all big sisterly <laughs> fashion. <laughs> what do you mean? Did I do the thing? <laughs> <laughs> How do you make all of your wishes yeah. come true? Right. So I explained this to her and she was like, well, will it work on all of my eyelashes? And I said, oh, yeah, of course. Oh, boy. Okay, now uh, this is Go good. on. This is a good trick. <laughs> what I'm hearing is that Tyler had a great year. <laughs> I, uh, she may have pulled out all of her eyelashes. Yeah, what? But, but, but worth it, right? I mean, how many wishes came true? She must have gotten so many lightsabers. Yeah. <laughs> that was very much not my intention. Of it, but um, that is definitely how she interpreted it, and she will never, ever, ever let me live it down. That's I, I would never let her live it down. <laughs> what are we yeah, talking right? about? <laughs> I think you're doing the prank wrong. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't supposed to be a prank, but she. It was a little bit of a prank, I guess. Did not on purpose. <laughs> Derek, did you ever prank your friends oh, growing up? Yeah, like... Oh, come on now. Uh, oh. I'm on a boost. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. So you've got the uh, an older brother and two younger brothers. Yeah, right? yeah. No, we did all kinds of stuff. Uh, especially um, April Fools used to be my favorite holiday. Aww. Uh, um, every single like textbook April Fools joke definitely did. Like the uh, the rubber band on the sprayer for the sink. Oh, oh that's a great, yeah, that's a good that's one. A good that's one. a good it's one. Like, did you do the saran wrap? Saran wrap. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, like Replace the salt with the, the sugar. Yeah. Ruin dinner. Ruin <laughs> <laughs> dinner. Hashtag worth it. <laughs> Not really. <Man. laughs> Did you still have to eat it? Uh, no, no, no. My mom didn't make me eat it at all. <laughs> I don't think I got food that night, but I should make me eat it. Wait, so did you make everything sweet or everything salty? Uh, everything was real, real sweet. Oh, God. <laughs> That's horrible. Did she not realize it when she was cooking? No, not at all. Uh, oh man, it's hilarious. That's gonna be a win. No, it's not. Oh. Is it? Maybe. Yes! Yes! Oh! I did it! Look at this. Just like I drew it up. Just, do, just do, like do, I do, drew do, it up. Do, do, do. Oh yeah. They barely knocked it themselves. They barely knocked it in themselves. Winner. Blue. Blue. Go team blue! Go team blue. Watermelons! Go watermelon sharks! <laughs> oh man, what a great team. You old watermelon sharks. Well guys, thank you so much for your questions. Hope you enjoyed another episode of the Unfair Watermelon Shark Challenge. Uh, <laughs> you got that like out so quickly. It's <laughs> so much easier to say than the Chud the Cannon <laughs> Boom Challenge Season League <laughs> Reward Rules. Yep. Yeah, whatever. Oh, Which man. we lost. Uh, the saddest game of the season. It was. Who would have thought? Yeah, anyway. if everybody wants to go and check out episode Boom Boom Boom. boom. Oh, yeah. As it stands right now, that video has no dislikes. Oh, man. Oh, Why oh, didn't you say it? I'll dislike it. Jeez. No! Oh. It's it's a good episode. Oh man, ever take the door off the hinges? Oh god. <laughs> <laughs> so, like when they go to open it, the door just comes <laughs> off. It comes clean off. <laughs> Classic! Oh man, I just remember that one. Oh, oh man. man. I've never done that one, but I'm going oh, it's to. Good. It's a good one. I've done ice water over a shower curtain. Oh, yep, I've yep, done yep. that too, yeah. that's so man, fun. I, one I've never done, but I always thought <laughs> looked awesome. It just seemed like so much effort was when you just Did cover the too? floor yeah. in like cups and fill each cup with just like an ounce of water or something. <laughs> <laughs> so it's just like, you can't. You have to like physically pick up each one and pour it out. Right, we're not actually playing. I was gonna do another one. What's happening no, here? We're not. This is the end of the episode. That was a prank. We just man. played on the whole guys. Oh, 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 oh man! All right. Yeah. Until next time. Bye. Bye.